Hi, hi, hi. Um, today is Friday the 20th of November 2020 and the time is um, 5 minutes to 11. Um, 22.55 hours and I'm doing the unboxing. Well, I just unboxed uh, my new stainless steel inner pot for my HD2139 slash 62 Philips pressure cooker and I also got a new uh, o-ring this um, ceiling ring uh, which is basically a gasket uh, one thing I noticed oh you see well to get it, let me show you how shiny and beautiful it is uh, compared to my old one where the Teflon has mostly worn um, you know it looks like modern art now and uh, if you look at the bottom uh, because of the friction and the abrasion, it's, it's very warm. I, I'm not so bothered about the outside, the Teflon coating on the outside going, but on the inside, uh, definitely it's been on its last legs. And I've been saving up for quite a while um, to, to, to get these items. Uh, one thing I noticed is on the old uh, pot, uh, the graduations on the left, if you look closely, they are uh, two-thirds, one-third, and you know, whatever. I ignore the ones for the rice um, on the right because I hardly bother with that. I just look at the, you know, whether it's... Um, when you put things, it has to be between one-third, which is there, and two-thirds, which is there. Uh, it shouldn't be less than um, uh, one-third. Anyway, um, and two-thirds is the maximum capacity. Anyway, on the new machine, uh, instead of uh, dividing it into thirds, they divide it into fifths. So here you can see um, one fifth, here is two fifths, here is uh, three fifths, and uh, four fifths, and yeah. So I would think that I should fill it up between two fifths and three fifths okay that will be the equivalent roughly to uh, one third and two thirds uh, maybe up to four fifths which is 80% three three fifths is um, 60% uh, which is almost to two thirds which is 66% so I think it'll be safe to and, and one fifth is 20% one third is uh, 33% so I think it'll be safe to, to put things between uh, one fifth and two fifths okay um it's hot it, it's it's uh, what do you call it it's stamped so on the outside you can see the uh, the reverse of the marking okay um, it's i noticed there are these uh, spaces so these bulges are to create some space between the pot and the side wall of the pressure cooker uh, I just took it out of the box, haven't washed it yet, haven't used it yet. So I'm looking forward to using this and uh, I can retire this. Um, and uh, only when I need extra space to keep stuff, if I'm making two soups at one go, I'll make it in this and then use this as a storage container. Um, you know, if I'm making large amounts of soup. Uh, I've noticed previously if I'm making chutney or Iva or barbecue sauce, and then I want to make a soup and I can't, you know, put uh, stuff, you know, it's just too litchy while it's hot to put it somewhere else. So I can just take this out and put a new, uh, a new pot when I do that. Okay, so that's, um, so happy. It's my early Christmas present to myself. I've been saving up for a very long time, months and months and months and months for this from even before the MCO. Um, you know, if you can see, this is really end of life. It's, it's, you know, modern art already. Okay, so see you next time. Bye!